Hello and welcome to a brand new collective haul. This is going to be my haul for April, all the goodies that come in the mail sort of as the time goes on because I cannot wait to open packages. <laughs> Today we've got a couple of things, one really exciting thing, which I'm going to obviously end with because why not, uh, and a couple other things that are also fun and exciting. Um, I'm going in order of least exciting to most exciting. <laughs> This is actually a package from an eBay store um, for some brand new sleeves. Um, I was using, I don't even know what they're called, Ultra Pro, um, there I go. Uh, I was using Ultra Pro side loading sleeves for a while um, and they just were a little too small, I think, for the PCs. I wanted something that filled out the page a little bit more. So I went with what everyone seems to really love uh, and use, which are these Dragon Shield Clear Matte ones. These are the size for like regular album photo cards and like DVD photo cards, that kind of thing. Ooh. Um, and yeah, I got them from an eBay store. I don't know what it is, but if anyone's curious, I can link it down below. Um, you can get these on Amazon, but I got them a little cheaper from like a local card store. <laughs> Uh, and they just took a little bit longer to get here, but this is what they look like. I don't know if I specifically asked for the matte versions. I thought I was just getting like just the clear ones, but maybe all the Dragon Shields have that little like matte bit at the bottom or back. I don't know if I love that. Cause like, won't it make the card look a little weird? I don't know, let's try it out. Okay, here's like a card I got the other day. These are the sleeves I was using. They fit really nice and snug, but for some PCs, especially thicker ones, like the Lucky Draws, they're like too snug and that they bend the PC a little bit. Um, so here's the Dragon Shield. I mean, these are definitely way thicker. Come on. Yeah, they still look nice and clear. And I guess the matte doesn't bother me too much. I just feel like it might bother me on like the Love Yourself PCs that have the hollow on the back. I don't know. We'll have to investigate those to see if I like them. Um, but I have 200 of them now. <laughs> so hopefully. All right. Next is, I don't know, a sale or a trade. I really can't remember what this is. I think it's a trade, but I don't remember what it is. <laughs> Let's see. Let's find out together, shall we? Oh, oh come on. There we go. Or maybe this is something I bought. Oh, okay. Cute. This is Namjoon's persona postcard um, from this uh, Instagram person. This took a while because I think uh, they were mentioning that their Instagram got like hacked or something, but cool, this is finally here. So this will finish my persona postcard set. That's why I didn't know what this was because I would forgotten about it completely. There he is, little Namjoon, cute. I really do like these postcards. Okay, that's a fun surprise. <laughs> All right, and then last but very much not least um, is, I'm just so excited. First of all, <laughs> Nam June Lemna, which is super fun. Uh, it's a whole packet of them. <laughs> That's a freebie. That's funny. Um, but here is the main attraction. Oh my God, I'm so excited about these. Probably the PCs that I wanted the most. Uh, oh. <sighs> I found these for what I think was a really good deal about the price that I see them uh, elsewhere, but I don't know, I usually am like too late. When I was ready to buy them, it was about time. Okay, come on out, come on out. Please come out. <laughs> Please? Oh, okay, I got them. The tape got stuck to the top loader in the back and made it very hard. I don't have like a huge broadcast card collection, but I these are just so beautiful. I've always wanted to have them. Um, and that's silly because they're like some of the most expensive PCs other than, you know, the ones that are like super old, but please let me in. <laughs> yes, I found someone who was selling these on Instagram. Uh, I really wanted to buy them as a set as well. So here's both of them. <gasps> wow. They are so, so stunning. So this is the cute one. I love the backs on these because most of the broadcast cards are plain on the back. But these are so cute. Wow, these are in perfect condition. And then the cool one. Oh, wow, he looks so beautiful. These are also just like so, such high quality photos and stuff. Oh, wow. Yay! 
What an exciting package. All right, that's all that I have for you today, but uh, welcome to April. I'm sure there's many more packages on the way. Hello, I've got some exciting things today. One letter I'm very excited about. Um, you saw in the last clip that I just bought 200 Dragon Shield. Uh, sleeves and I bought the wrong ones. I got the clear matte and these are the clear classic. This is what I actually wanted. Um, the clear mats are not going to waste though. I have a friend who plays uh, Magic Gathering and those are the card sleeves he uses so I'm going to send them off to him to use. Um, but these are one of the ones I wanted. They are completely see-through all the way. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to resleeve my entire collection. <laughs> I don't know. It's going to be fun in a way but also kind of annoying in a way. So yeah, those are the right sleeves this time. All right, then let's open this little guy. I don't know exactly who, what this is. I thought I knew what it was, but I was a little thrown off by like the sender, but I might just have my names kind of confused. We shall see, we'll open it together. Oh, wow, what a really cute card. Let's see. What is this? Who is this from? This is really exciting. Uh, this is from this Instagram. Uh, yeah, and it's my first Namjoon 22920 muster card, second muster. Um, I wasn't planning on, well, that's not true. I was planning on collecting these. I wasn't planning on collecting them like just yet, uh, but they were selling them for such a good price. And then like randomly, um, the next day after I bought this one, someone else on Instagram, I can't even remember who it was, was selling two more of them also at a really good price. Um, so I've got three incoming now, which is crazy. Uh, so here he is. This is packaged very interestingly. Safe, but different than I've seen other things be packaged. Oh my gosh, come on. All right. This is seven of seven, two, two, nine, two, oh, wrap monster, which is so funny. I mean, so precious. Yeah, so if you collect these cards, you know, one, they're kind of hard to find because this was quite a while ago um, and they're just like really expensive. Like I've seen like individual of these go for like $50 each, not always Namjoon set, but yeah, they're usually pretty expensive. So I think I got this for like $7 or something like that, which just seemed, amazing so that'll be something i work on very very slowly um i also really want to watch this muster 22920 i think it's on one of the memories dvds someone let me know i can google it myself as well but um i don't know i kind of am weird about like i usually like to collect tour and muster D or pcs only after i've like seen the concert which is like weird and gatekeepy i don't know why i'm doing that to myself but i don't know that's just what i do this is from a very exciting go of a bunch of namjoon things i only got one thing because i was like new to the seller and i just didn't know um but yay this is their instagram since then i've like chatted with them a couple times um and they seem like a really great seller uh they find a lot of things from thailand i believe so it's kind of like a new market i guess um so this is namjoon's oops oops <laughs> oops <laughs> all right i'm full of chaos today <laughs> god this is Namjoon's uh, Love Yourself in Europe PC. So this is going to complete my Love Yourself DVD concert PCs. Okay, if I can get this open. Yeah, looking back, I wish that I had now bought more from this post um, because they were really good priced PCs and a lot of like Namjoon stuff I needed. Um, but anyway, here he is. Wow. This one of all of the Love Yourself PCs is just really hard to find. I don't know why. Does anyone know why? Was it like maybe Europe was the least bought DVD or something like that? But beautiful back. Beautiful photo. Love that. Let's try out one of these sleeves, shall we? Come here. Let's see what he looks like in there. Ooh, that is nice. <gasps> wow. Cool. So... That's it, that's what I've got today. Um, I know that there's a fun group order package coming soon, so I'll see you then. It's been actually many days since I got something in the mail, uh, so <laughs> I'm gonna open this even though it's only one letter, but it's a very exciting letter. This is from Pink Kismet on Instagram. Some of the, a group order manager that I like have worked with multiple times now, and I really like them. And this is a couple of things 
that I had coming from a couple of different goes. So I'm very excited to open it. All right. Let's see what we got. Woo! Oh, they always package things so beautifully. So yeah, that's their Instagram. Very much trust them. So sweet. Look at this little nom June. Okay, I'll open that in a second. Here are the cards I was waiting for. This is packaged so cute. I just, it's very nice when someone gives it this attention to detail just because they can. You don't have to, but it's just nice. Well, come on. Okay. <laughs> I will now have glitter all over my desk, which is not a problem. Okay. Oh, all right. Here are two fourth muster cards. Oh, these are so beautiful. This is three of eight. And this is one of eight. So yeah, I think I'm very nearly done with this collection. They're all coming in the mail at least. So that's those. I just love them. They're so pink and cute, <laughs> which I very much appreciate. This is the last magic shop card I need. So fifth muster. This is one of eight. So exciting to have this, my dream set complete. Love this. It's fun that his hair is silver again. All right, and then last, but definitely not least, completing an OT7 set for me. Oh, come on. This is Tay's Tear version YPC. This is really a beautiful set. So this is one of the sets I'm collecting OT7 for. And all I needed was Tay left, my problem child. Wow, what an exciting set of cards. All right, I just was impatient and could not wait. So there's probably more coming. <laughs> Another one letter, but exciting letter day today. Um, oh, I feel like I really don't have that much more mail coming, but then I, I also think that's probably not true. Oh, I don't know what the heck I'm cutting into in there. Lots of freebies and cuties and stuff. This is from an Instagram seller and oh, oh, they were selling a bunch of cards I still needed to complete OT7 sets. So yeah, um, it was like really nice to be able to get this all in one fell swoop. I feel like I paid a little bit more than I typically like to pay for like an album card. But because I was buying them all from the same seller and then shipping them like all at the same time, I saved money there. Like if I found each of these cards individually, I'd be paying for individual single shipping. Um, so it kind of just made sense to get them all at one time. Uh, plus now I'm done looking for these cards. Uh, I am missing one single photo card for my um, Love Yourself and like and more recent albums. And it is... Any member other than Namjoon and Hobie version one persona. So if anyone sees that for a good price, I kind of want Jimin just because I like his hair a lot in it, but I'd be happy with anyone. So finishing up these sets here is Tay, uh, Love Yourself Her L. I had this PC, but Jane really needed it. And so I sent it off to her, but then I was like, you know what? I'd like to have him back. So there's that. This is Jin version, Love Yourself Her version, what is it? Oh, right. Originally, I had done a trade with Yoongi, but it's just absolutely never showed up. I don't know if it just got lost or if someone just didn't want me to have it. <laughs> Who knows? But I really love this one as well. So Jin will fill that little third spot. And then to finish off my OT7 set, oh my god, I'm so excited to put this card away. This is JK's Mot7 version 3. This is like one of my favorite photo card sets of all time ever. Um, and this was the last one I needed. So yeah, this was an exciting letter to get. We'll see what the rest of the month brings us. Hi, I'm here with another single letter because this was just so, so nice. This person named Elizabeth, who I had sold to before, an extra Namjoon card, she's also a Namjoon collector, reached out and was like, hey, I was looking through your wish list again and like, I have an extra of this card that you need. Um, do you want to have it? And I was like, please let me give you something in return. Um, and, but she, she insisted and said, you know, I want you to kind of have it, which was so sweet. Um, so yeah, just thank you, Elizabeth, if you're watching. Um, I'm still going to look out for something to get you or give you. If there's anything you need, um, that I have or you want me to look out for, let me know because this was just really so, so sweet. 
Um, I found a fun, I've made connections with a couple fun Nam June collectors, which is just fun. Um, but yeah, here is a, a fourth muster happy ever after card. The last one actually that I needed. Uh, I think this is five of eight. And she sent it along my way, which is just so nice. So, so nice. Um, so yeah, Nam June says hi. <laughs> Thank you again, and this will complete uh, my whole collection for this for this set, which is super exciting to be done with. Um, I really, really love this set. But yeah, thank you, Elizabeth. I felt this was worthy to open alone and, and show you guys and say, you know, people are nice. The world is kind sometimes. <laughs> Hello, I've got a very exciting package all the way from Germany here. So someone that I am mutuals with on Instagram uh, reached out, I guess, after seeing one of my videos where I mentioned that I would trade... Um, my gin sao paulo bookmark uh if anyone had a hobie one yeah basically if anyone had a hobie bookmark in general um so we decided to do a trade this is like my first international trade which is super exciting um i usually do like usa only just because like i'm not super experienced in sending to other countries so i was always kind of nervous about it um but it's making its way this is there at a at tajini trades and there's hobie Oh my gosh. Okay, this is going to take me a second to get into and not mess up, I think. All right, that was very well packaged, so it took me a little while to get out of uh, it, the packaging. But here is Mr. Hobie. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I just love this bookmark a whole lot. This is the Wembley one. Um, that's what it looks like. There is a photo I love of Hobie, like, more than anything. I'll put it right here. I don't know if it's from this tour date, but he, like, looks very similar and that he, like, has his uh, Love Yourself, Speak Yourself shirt on, and it's just, it's so good. Um, so, I don't know. This is just a nice thing to have in my collection. Not something I thought I would kind of ever own because I really am just collecting Namjoon's DVD kind of stuff, but very excited to have this. Thank you so much for trading. Hi friends. When it rains, it pours. I have a couple things to open today, including an exciting box. So I'll do the lips first. I'm going to start with this one because I'm actually kind of sad about this. Um, I haven't showed it on my channel, I don't think yet, but uh, I was collecting and hyphen Jake and Jay and hyphen, I never know how to say it, but I don't know, with the release of the newest album, there's just too much to collect and these were hard enough to get. Um, but these are two uh, things that I got from a Go, from this uh, Go manager on Instagram. They were great. They like updated all the time. Very, very good. These are two JPCs and I've officially bought all of his uh, Border Day 1 um, album photo cards, but I just, I don't know. I'm not going to keep up with it. Um, it's just too hard to collect and I never finished Jake's so what I'm doing is just keeping one I can't open this so anyway what I decided to do is just keep one Jake and one J from each album version um so I don't even think these are the two that I'm going to be keeping of J's this is one of his Dusk PCs and one of his Dawn PCs um yeah Look out soon on my Instagram at Cypher Ray where I'm going to be getting rid of um, pretty much most of my hyphen collection. I decided to drop my collection after I had joined both these goes, so it was kind of sad, like paying EMS and stuff for cards I knew I was going to keep. But anyway, moving on to another exciting go. Um, I feel like that's kind of what I've been doing more often than not lately. I'm not really trading anything. Um, I don't know. It seems like a lot of the Instagram sales now are goes. Um, not now, like I've been here this long, but this was a very exciting one. You saw another one of these photo cards in earlier. Um, not a set that I was going to immediately start working on, but here we are. This is from this Instagram. They also were a great go manager. Um, Ooh, this is packaged very well. Appreciate that. How clever. Here are some more of Namjoon's second muster 22920. Um, PCs. I think there's two of them in here. Why is everyone wrapping stuff so good so that I can't open it on camera well? I actually looked up, um, I wanted to learn more about Second Muster. I haven't watched it yet um, because I think it's on Memories of, I think it's on Memories of 2016, which I don't have um, and don't really plan to get. So I've never seen it, but I want to know, I want to know more about it. If you've watched it, let me know your thoughts on it. These are so funny. This is um, five of seven, and this one is two of seven. I really love this set. 
I think everyone looks really, really nice in this like sepia tone. Um, but they are funny PCs and that like more than any other photo card I own, this feels like a piece of paper. <laughs> Uh, but alas, I got them for a really good deal, which you can't always find apparently with the 22920s. Anytime you see a package on my channel, assume it's from Jane. <laughs> you guys all know Jane, golden underscore JJK on Instagram and YouTube. Surprise, surprise that these are more lucky draws. Yay! <laughs> Here's the note from Jane. Thanks, Jane. Uh, I did ask her to send along one of the deluxe albums. I obviously have this already, but I had a big brain move. I'm gonna show it to you. So, obviously we know what this comes with. Um, lots of good stuff, but what I really wanted this for, okay, come on. <laughs> Get all the stuff out of here. Um, was, gosh, there's so much stuff in this, okay an extra copy of this photo book which i have not allowed myself to really look through because it purposely you know cracks in the middle i am going to take this apart and uh use it for arts and crafts which is really exciting so i've got an extra one of these and then this is the big brain move i'm currently using this box to hold all these cards i have to put away now it can be bts themed so like look at this these will go in here be safe and sound and delightful for them away so big brain move but the real reason that we any of us bought another freaking copy of deluxe <laughs> are for these beautiful okay what are these oh <laughs> i was like wait what are these i bought some extra pcs off of jane uh from a go because she didn't didn't need them anymore so this is nam june's pre-order benefit uh for be essential finally have that yay uh, this is Tay's random selfie card from Be Essential as well. Finally have that. I'm only missing Jimin uh, to complete OT7. And then these are the Lucky Draws from Deluxe. So, wow. We've got Mr. Namjoon. Um, I don't know which one's Soundwave and which one's MTU. Because I just, you know, see photo cards and jump. So, <laughs> who knows? This has got to be probably Hobie of the same set. Oh my gosh. Wow. He looks so cute. I love this orange suit on him so much. There's the back. Again, I don't know which one this is. I'm going to take a wild guess and say that it's MTU. Am I right? I don't know. 50 chance. We got another Namjoon. Oh, oh my gosh. He is so cute. Yeah, I wish I could poke your dimple too. Stop showing off. These are thicker, I think, than the, yeah, for sure, than the uh, essential ones. And last but not least, Mr. Hosok. Wow. So cute. His face is just so precious. These are so dusty. Wow. Look at those handsome boys. I mean, they're all handsome. So fun. Cool. And that's all for today's clip, but what a lovely clip it was. <laughs> See you in the next one.